what is up, what's going on, this is Luis Dupuy bringing you another video about how to Minecraft in this time with the sun shining above me, uh, but that's not what I want to show you, I want to show you this beauty right here not me, but the house just behind me, look at that, it's orange and I will show you the most epic house that I've built yet that is looking weird I mean, the most epic weird looking house, because look at that, it's yellow, orange and green so it fits where the ground is and everything fits with together look at the windows and the wood and stuff and the flowers and we have even like the little flower pot and the buttons everything is all right and i don't know how i came across this but it went really well so you can see like everything is orange we even got some carrots above here so for the extra detail you know you need those carrots and then some chest and some furnaces and a bed obviously and everything you'll need and even an armor and brown because it's fitting the most but look at it it looks beautiful all right so i get this little place right here where you can build your house but you can build it wherever you want I got a chest here and now I'm gonna show you the items you'll need. You'll need some redstone slabs, redstone sta stairs, some jungle doors, some hay bales and some orange stained glazed paints. And those are the basic materials for the building and also some grass blocks. And those are for the outside obviously. So what I want you to do is basically start anywhere you want and then place basically one, two and three blocks here. One gap here. So on the right side one gap and then three blocks once again. And then starting from here, so you already place this one, you place one, two, three, four and five and it will be six blocks in total. Do exactly the same on the other part, so start from here, one, two, three, four, five. And then basically you just rejoin this row and you'll get like some free space here. Then you just go uh, one in, beh uh, in behind like this one and then you put two blocks here. And you basically fill this whole gap with some slabs or some stairs to get like that little weird texture. But do whatever you want. I'll place like some four blocks here. Look at that. Looks beautiful. Orange. I like orange. Alright. There we go. And then you need to start right here. Alright, so now we'll place the actual wall which is made of hay bales. So start right here. Build one, two and three. Then against this, one, two, three. Then you go one, two, three. Remove those two blocks and you'll get like a door entrance. Do the, exactly the same right here. So one, oh, actually here, one, two, three. Against this, one, two, three. So that you'll get like that little hay bill placed differently. Right? Then you go around once again and you go one, two, three. One, two, three. Then you go one, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. And then basically here, you go around on the corner. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. That's it. Then against those, you place the bales, hay bales, uh, once again, so that you'll get like on this side, like the white wall, and on this side, those stripes. So fairly easy. Do the, exactly the same. Basically, you need to remove those blocks right here. This one this one and then we'll remove some more blocks later on right here all right so once that is done you can actually take the door go on the inside place it like that now we can start with a roof so what you want to do is place a roof like that one like this so you got two there do exactly the same on the other side but you'll actually repeat the same thing so just like this and then you need to do one two and then on top of it one two one block and one block on top of it just like this do the same on the other side so let's do that real quick boom and boom like this and do the same Ooh, and come on place place it what you doing right like this and there we go and now we can actually finish this part so you just go all the way up like this until you rejoin this particular middle part and then you place one upside down like this can go wrong uh, unless you go too far away but I think that you can you will be able to see the middle so it's pretty easy and I have to do right now is just like place one two here then one 
two going all the way until here and this one as well there we go look at that and then basically do the same here boom and boom and boom and then for the middle part once again like this and then you place one on top of it one on top of it take the slab go all the way until you rejoin this part right and then here once again do the same it's a fairly easy roof to build and look at that beautiful all right and now just go all the way there and do the same so one to this side one to this side and this one all the way there then you take one single slab place it here and one single slab place it here and one two rejoins correctly and now you'll see those parts that are empty really easy all i need to do now is basically place those blocks on top where the parts are missing and then you place one here one here one here and you go basically all the way up until here and then one two three one two three just like this one more on top of it here one one and fill those gaps in really easy look at that and boom 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 and voila and voila that's all you need to do all right so now you can take actually some more materials that are actually inside you can actually place one single piece of stair right here as well so look at that and then take the leaves we'll actually take the things for the outside uh, keep that for now boom 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 and boom 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 all right look at that now we'll start doing actually we'll start removing the rain because it's kind of annoying then you need to take the leaves and place one two three four five six seven and you place one piece of dirt here one two three four and then one two three four five pieces of dirt just like this and one two three four and then take one piece of dirt once again and then one two three four five six seven just like this and then all you need to do is basically place one here one here one here one here one piece of dirt one piece of dirt fairly easy i must say and then you take the fences right here some more fences right here then you take more fences right here so you take a lot of fences basically and then you do this then you take the stair you place one like this one like this boom and one like this then you remove if i'm right yes i am you remove a one block here and you place one single piece of window then one single piece of window here and here what we will do is basically remove those two and place two windows here and then you can go ahead and place one stair like this one stair like this one slab then go one two up one two up one stair facing this way one stair facing this way and one facing this way so you should get like a window like that and then all you need to take after this is uh, let's see let's see let's see boom the trap doors place them against those grass blocks just like that and now what we're gonna do is place like the yellow flowers just beneath those two stairs then take the orange flowers place a one pot flower pot on top of it i will take it here because it's quicker righty you take it here and you place one single yellow flower in front of the orange window and then here basically what you need to do is place just like a four block place an acacia fence gate remove it obviously and place one single trap door on top of it then you take the trap door and basically just cover that up that grass block and then you take a yellow of orange flower sorry you go on the other side do exactly the same so fairly easy boom 
and then you take the window once again and basically we need to do this first because otherwise we're not able to place it down all right and then take the trapdoor just like this once again fairly easy and then you need to take those fences do exactly the same thing on the other side so we should get something like this so far looks pretty good and take the trapdoor once again trapdoor once again and he will do exactly the same like this then here you need to take one trapdoor and once again one flower pot and one yellow flower just like this then you take the buttons and if I'm right you need to place one here one here and one here just like this then on the sides here you place buttons all the way just like this do exactly the same there boom boom let me take a quick look once again if I yes 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 all right everything is great everything is looking great so basically you need to take the buttons and place one here one here one here and whoop one here all right so now let's go to the inside and basically build the rest of it so let me take that real quick into my inventory just like that all right so now you need to take all those stuff so first I'll take the bed and those things fancy all right and if I'm right I need to yeah all right so take the bed place it right here then you need to take some stairs like the red sandstone stairs or some wood actually it's some acacia wood but if I were you I would use this one just like this and then basically all you need to do is basically rejoin those blocks here boom like that and boom and then place one here one here one uh, one here one here then take the slab place one here one here fairly easy then you take the crafting table place it right there and then take once again the red sandstone stairs place shift place one like that one like that take some orange carpet shift and place it all the way over those things and then you can go ahead and take the uh, item frames place one here one here take the carrots I like to position them differently just like this look at that then you need to take the ladders build them all the way until there take the chest and the furnaces one furnace here one chest here one chest here one chest here one chest here so that should be it for the chest and stuff then you can go ahead and take the rest redstone lamp crafting table we don't need that don't need that and don't need that look so let's take the rest of the I lost it all right so take the redstone lamp place one here and basically all you need to do now is just place those things like this you can use some stairs or some four blocks whatever you would like and basically you need to place them like this and you should get like the lamp like hanging out like this they could go ahead and remove this and then take some armor stand there we go and obviously the armor place it right down here and place everything on top of it like that we got our armor stand looks good and then we need our brew brew brewing stand can pronounce it right just like this and if I'm right we should get another flower pot ready and take another flower which is yellow why not look at that looks great all right and then you can go on top of the building you can remove the middle block right here you can take the daylight sensor you can click right click once again on top of it you placed on night 
and then you can take the slab and that will be it if I'm right let me check it real quick while I'm still talking to you and yes look at that I've done everything right with my head and stuff ah I feel pretty proud doing the tutorial in one time without failing or anything look at that looks great don't you think so if you did like this video don't forget to leave a like comment and subscribe guys because that means a lot for me and obviously the lamp will go on at night and off at day or not let's edit at night time to finish it up time set night look at that now it's night and it's on and we got that beautiful lighting effect with rain pouring down everywhere. But look at that house. It looks amazing with some blocks that you actually would never use. But oh well, by further ado, this was the tutorial, guys. And I hope that you like it. If you did, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe and comment. Because it means a lot for me. So I'll see you the next time, guys. And until the next tutorial, stay in touch and stay awesome. Goodbye.